Okay. I have so much respect for these women. If they don't go and collect the fire with the cell, they don't have any money. Like, they don't have any income. So we went up to the area where we met the woman before them. We followed them into the woods, and we're hiking up. And it is a very, very steep incline. Now, and they had no shoes on. They were barefoot. They got to this kind of flat point, and they all sat down and got ready and said a prayer. And that was really cool to watch. So that was awesome to watch that. And then they all kind of split up. Like, two went high and two went low, and we followed the ones that were going low. And they don't bring water or anything really with them. They will collect the wood and keep going. They don't stop. But, um, and here I am in the back, like, panning. Slow down. Hold on. I just need a break. The wood weighs approximately 30 pounds. And then we went back to meet them as they were coming out of the woods and we got to follow the mama. She was in such high spirits, the mama we followed back from the woods and was so positive and laughing and happy and I just couldn't believe it because I was exhausted just from going out that morning and I can't believe how they did it. And my backpack felt heavy and here these are these women doing it every day with 30 pounds, barefoot. Uh, it was just amazing. So we hiked 10 kilometers that day. And then we go to her house with her. And, you know, she puts the sticks down. She's sitting on them. And then she shows us her room, which is so small and so dark. And she has, I think she had five kids, but she lived there with two. The other three were older and getting jobs and stuff. But it was so small and so dark. And she takes this kind of like pitcher and pours herself a glass of water and drinks it. And it's brown. And I just couldn't believe it because, you know, after all that, she comes home and she has a little glass of brown water. So that was kind of hard to watch. An amazing experience. Like, I have so much respect for these women. Yeah. <laughs> Like, give me a favor.